right here. What's up everybody? It's your boy the legend here with another Skull Island Reign of Kong construction update coming at you from the Toon Lagoon post. Of course, Drew the intern joining me again. Yeah, man, you know what this fountain over here where the little kids are playing in? I'm not gonna take video of little kids playing in a fountain. <laughs> well, I was playing in it and I got some dribbles of splash on me. Dribbles of splash. There we go. But we're not here to talk about Drew and his dribbles of splash or Dan and his staring into the Kong structure. But the structure itself, uh, obviously this is a very cool spot, and almost all of the facade, at least from this standpoint, is pretty much done. It and it looks really amazing, It of looks course. pretty cool. Um, we do these about every two weeks, so there's been a huge, huge push in the past two weeks. Now from over here, from what you can really see that I like as a huge nerd, they've got the giant mechanism in for the door that'll open and close as your ride vehicle goes into the show building. Right there, you can see that. So that, that's pretty cool from a nerd standpoint. Obviously you have some more exposed steel going over here that they're not quite done yet. And we'll get to that in a little bit. But uh, for this angle, you know, for a ride that doesn't open for about 11 or 12 months, it's pretty damn good. We'll check in more later. Well, we're here to stop number two, uh, Legend Drew the Intern. Yep, that's me. All right, taking a look at this. And what's kind of interesting here is you can see this shot here, everything's all done. But then when you pan over, over to here, you see some of the rock work that's really not quite done yet. That's the blue stuff. Yeah, and the gray stuff. It's it goes delicious. <laughs> Thanks, Lumiere. Um, it goes from gray to blue to these uh, kind of like charcoal kind of colors. And then obviously up there where it's not quite done yet. Can you tell what it is? It's King Kong. It's going to be a Kong. Yeah. And there's that video from here. As Drew the intern informs guests, what's going on? Coming now from our perch high above Camp Jurassic, we get the, uh, what really is the best view of the Kong structure going on. And uh, really gets a cool view of uh, seeing from one side to the other, as far as you know, the scaffolding still up with the walls, where there's no walls at all. And of course the coolest view of the facade itself. The uh, Earth face. The Earth face. Now, now, Drew, you've had some uh, journalistic uh, opinions of what these faces look like here, and what would that be? Uh, to me, the lower two look kind of like vaginas. All right. Well, whether you agree with Drew's vagina comment or disagree, please let him know in the comments. Is he is he alone in his nymphomaniac, or is he validated? Well, to be fair, I think at least three fourths of our audience are males, so they will agree. All right, there you go. Again, another shot of the, the door infrastructure that's already in place. Um, pause really quickly. After uh, some breaking news from Drew, he wanted me to point out to all of you. Will it get in focus? Will it get in focus? You can see something huge over there. Yes, the fun spot thing, which is terribly shifting up and down, but it's over there if you want to see the sky coaster. But again, back to um, Kong. What I found really interesting today too is these things here. These um, odd theme, it looks like lampposts or torches or something. I'm not really sure what those are for there, but uh, they're there. And then you can see on the other side of the entrance over, over here, there's the ones that don't appear to be quite done yet. So that's, um, that's interesting too. And then you it get- It's very interesting. You get a- uh, Drew is humping behind me. This is just me. <laughs> well, well, what are you doing here? I am watching the construction. He's a personal. <laughs> go away, go over there. Go to that corner. I have a bar here. Go under the bar. So you are you admitting we ducked under the bar? Yes. Go under well, the bar. That's what we're supposed to do. You're not supposed to go over the bar. That would kill little kids if they fall into this hole. <laughs> go over. Bleh. Go over there. <laughs> Far away from my noose. Thank you. <laughs> Back to Kong. And uh, uh, pretty cool. Uh, the construction looks amazing. Again, here when I'm not getting violated from behind, gives you a very brief view of what the inside will look like. Again, there they're pretty much finished. I'm gonna rough cut, rough cut, rough cut, bam. Over here, not finished at all, as you can tell. You know, still construction equipment in there. 
and there we go. Obviously, very little to finish up, up here construction-wise. All right, we're gonna go, uh, and then there's this. This is actually pretty interesting, too. This one, this one uh, little tiny corner, I'm guessing they're gonna make this whole gray background look like that. So it kind of blends into the jungle theme. And that was the first time we've seen that. Anyway, so that's your, your Kong structure update. Let's see if we find anything else interesting.